Overpasses for pedestrians and bicyclists who use the Legacy Trail in Sarasota, they're coming soon. 10 Tampa Bay's Dory Chumba tonight with the update on how these additions are designed to improve safety for the thousands of people who use it. I'm currently here on B Ridge Road, which is one of two intersections where construction work has already begun on what would be an overpass along the Legacy Trail. A bridge would be nice. It'd be a lot safer, I guess. This legacy trail overpass will look similar to this one on Laurel Road. The pedestrian bridges will include retaining wall ramps on both approaches to each bridge. Some trail users say it will reduce the chances of trail users colliding with motorists. There are some idiots out here who just uh, don't believe in these lights at all, especially on a busy road. With the constant stopping with people using the trail and so many people using the trail, um, I, I'm sure it's going to help with that quite a bit. Sarasota County Park officials say they are keeping an eye out for speeders on the trail. The sheriff's office is also increasing visibility along the trail with deputies on mounted patrol to help both educate and enforce the rules of the trail, including the 15 mile per hour speed limit. We know that the Legacy Trail is an incredible amenity for Sarasota County for our citizens and our visitors. We just ask them to be educated on how to properly use the trail um, and just be good stewards of it. The only downside I see is that it's going to add more elevation to my ride. <laughs> In Sarasota, Aduria Chumba, Tan Tampa Bay. Yeah, now you got those hills. Construction for the pedestrian overpass at B Ridge and Clark Roads, that's going to take about two years. There will also be additional overpasses at Beneva, Bahia Vista, and Tuttle Road.